Hello and welcome to Devotions. Today on my way to work, I was looking up at the sky. The blue sky mixed with clouds made me relax. I ended up looking at dogwood trees and seeing that they were in full bloom. And it made me smile. It made me think, what I look at impacts who I am. What I look at impacts how I see myself, how I see the people around me, and even how I see God. The scripture that I want to look at today says this. The one who comes from above is above all. The one who is of the earth belongs to the earth and speaks about earthly things. The one who comes from heaven is above all. Where we look changes who we are and what we are about. And this scripture is metaphorical, but also has a lot of truth to it. When I look above, I begin to see the grandeur and the beauty of the world that God created. And whether it be an incredible uh, evening sky that shows the Milky Way, or if it shows the night sky in Philadelphia where it's like 15 to 30 stars, it's still an amazing thing to focus on. And it helps me to let go of myself. It makes me see how small I am. And not small in a bad way, but actually small in a good way. Because when I focus on the one who comes from above, I spend less time focusing just on myself. And God created us not to always be thinking about ourselves, looking at ourselves, focusing on ourselves. We're actually supposed to focus on God and even though it's the creation I'm looking at, as a Christian, it automatically draws me to the Creator, to God, to Christ, who was in heaven before the earth was created and was a part of creating the earth and all that is in it, and then comes to earth and returns to heaven after he dies and is resurrected. When we focus on things that are above, it makes us better people. It actually draws us closer to God and helps us become more like God. All too often, however, we are the one who is of the earth and we belong to earthly things. I don't know, maybe a six or seven times in my life, I'm walking in the mud and I'm wearing shoes instead of boots. And as I pull my leg out of the mud, uh, my foot comes with it, but the shoe is left in the mud. What are those things of the earth that get you stuck? What are the things of the earth that make it so that you're not focusing on the things that are above? our stresses, our anxieties, our hurts, our resentments. All of those things make it hard to look for the things above. You and I get to make a conscious choice. What are we going to look at today? Are we going to look at the things that are above or look at the things that are below? The truth is, if we are willing to look at the things above, we start to become more fully the person that Christ wants us to be. And therefore, when people look at us, they're not just seeing the things of the earth anymore. They begin to see the things that are above. And we might actually help them choose to look above instead of the things of the earth. Have a blessed day.